Oh my gosh, look at this wig. This wig got me feeling like I am that girl. And it was only $20. So it's a U-part wig by Outre in the style Dominican Blowout. It's 22 inches and I got the color natural black. So this is what the construction of the cap looks like. It comes with three combs up at the top, one on each side and one in the middle. It also comes with one comb on each side of the wig and one comb in the back. And these combs are not too small and not too big and they actually work really well. So I'm just making sure that this wig matches my natural hair color and it does. Like I said, I got the color natural black, but it does come in quite a few different colors. So this is what the card looks like that came in the box. It tells you all the details and on the back, it gives you instructions on how to install this wig, which I feel like installing a U-part wig is pretty easy. But if you don't know, then it does give you instructions on how to do so but you could just watch me instead. <laughs> so right now I'm just prepping my hair to see where I want my part to be and how much hair I want to leave out. So apparently you can also wear this as a side part, which I can't wait to try because I love a good side part. But I decided to just do a middle part just because it was so darn cute as you can see like oh my gosh <laughs> so I decided to leave some hair out on the sides just because I want it to look as natural as possible plus I feel like this is gonna be a bomb everyday look like I don't know I just picture myself rocking this every day and I can already tell I'm gonna get some stairs because this hair is a fire. <laughs> so right now I am just trying to figure out how much hair I want to leave out. This doesn't have to be perfect because guess what? Ain't nobody gonna see it. <laughs> so right now I'm just trying to make sure that I left out enough hair and you can definitely cut the strings that are attached to the wig on the little card it says you can keep them on but I don't know how that would work if you kept them on so I went ahead and cut those strings after I was super hype about installing this wig like I don't remember the last time I was so excited about installing a wig but right now I am just braiding the sides of my hair just so it is out the way when I braid the rest so this is what my braids look like. Don't judge me because I took them down right after because I had to wash my hair. I just really wanted to show you all this wig because like I said, I was super excited. So this is what the braids look like, a hot mess. But it doesn't matter what your braids look like. You really don't even need braids. As long as your foundation is flat, that's all that matters. But I would say braid around the leave out area just so your clips have something to hook on to because you really don't want to snag your hair unless you use like bobby pins or something so i put a wig cap on don't ask why i just do for some weird reason it just makes me feel secure i guess i don't know but you don't have to do that it's definitely optional. And look how cute the little swoops are on the side. I'm going to see if it holds a curl just because I feel like the swoops on the side just needs a little refreshing. So I'm going to start off by using the wig comb that's located in the middle and I'm going to clip that in into my braid and then I'm going to clip in the wig combs that are located on the top side and clip those in onto those braids. 
Um, I didn't use the combs that were located on the side of the wig. I just used the three at the top and the one that's located in the back. And as you can see, I was struggling a little bit because the hair was like too close to my face, which all I had to do was um, bring the wig back, which I don't know why I didn't do that, but it's okay because I figured it out and nothing was showing. I just didn't understand why I didn't bring back the hair. So now I'm just going to clip the one that's in the back and I am good to go. So this is the moment of truth, y'all. Let's see what it's looking like. Y'all cannot tell me this wig does not look good. Like, it frames my face perfectly, and it just gives me this glow, this smile. I just feel, like I said, I feel like I'm that girl. Wait until I get my eyelash extensions done. Just wait. Okay, I'm being extra, but that's how I was feeling inside. Like, I was feeling some type of way. I was really feeling myself, okay? And it's super soft, and I feel like it blends in perfectly with my hair. Um, I don't even need to straighten my hair to, like, get it to blend. It just looks so natural to me. So I can't wait to go wash my hair and reinstall this wig because I'm going to wear it every day. I'm pretty sure I will. So if you see me with this wig on all the time, just mind your business and act like it's my hair. <laughs> so I'm just brushing it a little bit. Um, like I said, it's so soft and it's so pretty. And yeah, look at it. Just look. <laughs> anyways y'all i'm gonna let you all go and i hope you all enjoyed watching this video and i will catch you all next time and don't forget to like subscribe and please comment because i love when y'all comment on my videos because i love chatting with you all and for the ones that comment all the time on my videos hey don't stop don't stop because I know your names. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching, y'all.